So what are they going to do? Expand, of course. They're moving down the road to a new facility in Nottingham. 7,500 square feet of space to do what they do best, make crab cakes. Another busy afternoon at the Pappas Seafood Company, packing orders of crab cakes and crab soup to be sent around the country. It absolutely was a godsend when that, when that happened for us. Karen Zimmerer, managing partner and CFO of Pappas, helped start the mail order business back in 2008, taking orders over the phone, then starting a website. It took off from there, and 13 years later, they've run out of space. We moved from the crab room up to this attached building that we used to rent out to Bateman's. And um, from here, we're going to the new warehouse in Perry Hall. Well, it doesn't look like much from the outside, but this facility on Bel Air Road will be the new corporate headquarters and the state-of-the-art crab cake shipping facility for Pappas, something actually in the works before COVID. We have a gourmet uh, commercial kitchen a separate cold shipping area, and then a huge warehouse that houses five walk-ins uh, to store soups and uh, freezer packs and crab meat. And so um, it's everything that we need to make us uh, more productive. A mailing crab cakes has increased in popularity with other restaurants like Jimmy's Famous Seafood and GNM running similar operations. But as Zimmerer tells us, when COVID hit, mailing crab cakes is what kept Pappas afloat and will now help take things to the next level. So we're still dealing with the, the COVID mess and everything else and a high cost of goods. And we're trying to uh, maintain the crab cake below $30 for our customers. So, um, you know, there's a lot of factors involved, but um, we're sitting in a decent position now, and this is what we've been looking forward to for years. So, And the new facility is expected to be finished in June, and move-in will begin shortly after that. In Parkville, I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL, TV 11 News.